Salisbury, we woke up early and caught the first bus to Hallstatt. The famed town of Hallstatt made its place in history as a salt mining town. Known as the Hallstatt period, 800 BC, during the European Iron Age, it distributed salt all over Europe, even aiding to the Austrian Empire. Today, tucked away in the Alps, along a glacial lake, it is a tourist destination, as well as a World Heritage Site. Our first stop was to pay homage to St. Michael's Parish and Cemetery. The historical significance of the area, as well as its steep topography, made grave sites a luxury. Because of this, the town resorted to recycling grave sites and storing bones in what is now known as the Bone House. No footage was taken as respect to the dead. We stayed at the Weiss's Lamb Guest House. It was warm and comfortable and came with all the modern amenities of a 21st century hotel, even though the hotel was built in the 16th century. The balconies offered beautiful views. The next day we made our way to the Dostein cable cars and the Mammoth Ice Cave. Caves containing running water and ice are relatively rare, and the Mammoth Cave is one of the largest in the world. We thought the tour curators did really well to create a dramatic and interesting tour of the large natural ice features. Traveling higher into the Alps, we enjoyed views of both Hallstatt and Dachstein glaciers. We eventually made our way to the Five Finger Overlook. High above Lake Hallstatt, the structure is built over a thousand foot cliffside and is not for the faint of heart. Nearing the end of the day, we made our way down from the mountains just in time to catch the Hallstatt sunset. Mm -hmm. 